At the National Museum of African American History and Culture, we're interested in telling a new narrative about the American past, one that centers and is focused on the country through the African American lens. My name is Paul Gardulo. I graduated from Rutgers in 1990 with a degree in English. Being a curator here at the National Museum of African American History and Culture has been the journey of a lifetime. It's my dream job. It comes with an enormous weight and a sense of responsibility. In many ways, this is a people's museum because people from across the country helped to build it through donating their treasures to us. And so we're telling a big story, but it's important for us to tell that story in human ways, in ways that anyone can relate to it, because this is a museum for all people. I think the museum is powerful because it operates on a number of levels. First and foremost, the museum is powerful because of the stories we're telling through objects. With the case of things as large as an airplane or as a house or as small as remnants of shattered glass windows from a bombed church in Alabama. These objects help us tell a more truthful and a more full story of our nation's history. Those objects then can become powerful windows into our own souls can become powerful motivators for change. No matter how different we may look or feel, we share a common history, and that history is sometimes fraught with challenges, but it is ours to grapple with and to understand in order to make better sense of our present.